Maybe I'm trying to get a raise. Your whole head be off. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Diana, and if you're returning, hey girl, hey. Today is Wednesday. Um, I'm about to cook Papa some breakfast. I'm hungry, but I don't want eggs, so he just gonna eat eggs and waffles. And I'm about to find me something else to eat, cause y'all know pregnancy symptoms. You don't know what the hell you want. But, um, yes, Papa. You got it? And then today, we gotta get out the house, so it's one of them days. Um, I'm gonna take some clothes back that I got for him that they don't fit, so we're gonna go do that. And I need to stop at Target and get an ironing board. Go ahead and get his breakfast going and start the day. All right, let's do it. Push it over. There we go. Look. Milk. Milk for Papa. Look at that. I got to make you some breakfast. Because you be tearing them eggs up. Good job. Now let Mommy make you some breakfast. So we can go bye-bye. Okay, get your toys. Get your toys. Get your toys. You happy now? I don't play by my food. Ah! Look, I'm so sick of this tripod. I need to order a new one. It's giving junky. Tokyo Tony video. I am so weak. Like, I don't have it in me to remake that video. It is so hilarious. <laughs> Your whole head be off. The first thing my daughter says, you better not use no martial arts on nobody. Yes. So I said, oh, this bitch gonna call the law. So I relax. And I look at him and say, don't you ever put your mother in the hands of me again. And then I walked out. Shake man. Go. I'm taking my side. <laughs> okay, we dressed. These are the outfits. They're so cute, but the pants are too big. Aren't they so cute? They're so colorful. Oh my goodness, I love him. So it's been about two weeks, so I'm like, okay, let me just, I gotta return them. And I keep saying I'm gonna go do it, and I don't go do it. Okay, I got the receipt. Here you go, give you some water. Why is this open? Where's the top? I don't know. Go ahead and head out. I said I was going to Target, but I'm not going to Target because I was going to get an ironing board, but I'm thinking, where am I gonna put the ironing board? So there's no point in me going to Target. I am definitely thriving to be like financially literate. You know what I mean? Like I ain't trying to keep up with the Joneses. I'm not trying to do unnecessary things that I don't have to do. If I ain't gotta go to Target and spend two, three hundred dollars, what am I going to Target for? I just want to be like more responsible with my finances. <laughs> just exchange just get 12 months instead of 18 months so I might just get like cloth outfits instead that's what I'm thinking so we'll see hello hello you want to get out huh huh you go have me chasing around the store I'm gonna get these two room sprays. They smell so good and I got a candle. And we have to go because he's starting to get drunk. You ready?
Hey y'all, so I just made it back. Let me show y'all what I got. I went to Carter's. I just love Carter's because I don't know if I mentioned this before, but they're so cheap and their clothes are good quality. <clears throat> a couple of this stuff, I just got a bigger size, but I think I left. <clears throat> I think it was like one outfit I didn't want. But the original time I went, just the original one, I got one two three four five six seven eight eight outfits for a hundred dollars but you cannot beat that they always come through but i'm gonna eat all this ice this was a new one i got i just love this green and these little shorts are so cute they're like an army fatigue so yeah <laughs> I know y'all seen Target. I didn't go to Target, but the Target is connected to the mall. So, to my word, and I didn't go to Target. I'm starting to record lots and lots and lots of content, but I just have had time to actually edit it and put it out there. It's better stay on the keychain. I was taking a nap, so I got about two hours before I'm back on. Monday. Oh, and I got some socks. Can never go wrong. Find the boy's socks. I hate when his socks start looking dingy. Like, especially his white socks. They start looking dingy. Throw that away. I don't know. I think I got a little OCD in me. Like, I might have a little OCD because certain things, like, irks irks me like when his socks are dirty like i want to throw them away i hate when my bathroom is dirty like right now i'm just thinking about i need to clean my bathroom it's not dirty but it's not clean either like it's like in that middle i feel like i need to sweep the floor and like scrub the shower what is wrong with me <sighs> i don't know bye y'all really bad diarrhea and I don't know what to do to treat it and now he has like a diaper rash so I definitely know I have to go find some medicine for the diaper rash and then um I've been like on so far like on google trying to figure out how can I treat it and I still I haven't came up with anything um so Monday I'm gonna go ahead and call his doctor to, yeah yeah on Monday, I'm going to call his doctor to um, to see, you know, like what I can do to kind of help him. Um, but they did say give him like Pedialyte. So we have some here from the last time um, he was vomiting and stuff. So I'm going to put some of that in his bottle because I don't want him to get like dehydrated. Um, so I'm going to give him some of that. And then, yeah, I'm going to have to go get some diaper rash cream because he has never had a diaper rash ever. So I don't have none here. I'm going to go do that and then <laughs> see if I can help my baby. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. I'm sorry, Bobo. Let me get your Pedialyte. He would not let me. He's so clingy to. Let mama get your Pedialyte. <laughs> Don't look at my booty. Okay. 
Alright. Alright, Jay. Yeah. What the hell is this? I'll take it. <laughs> Good morning guys, so it is the next day and yeah, I know how you start feeling like you getting yourself in a slump and that's how I started to feel this morning. I, every couple of weeks, I just start to feel myself getting into this little slump and I'm starting to notice, well I started noticing it this morning. I don't know, I just started to feel it coming on and I was like, no, I don't want to go into a slump because I'm not productive and I'm not very excited about anything. So this morning I'm like, okay, let me get up fast. I woke up at like 8.30, I'm like, let me just get up. Let me do my hair, let me put on a word. I put on Sarah Jakes and put on Sarah Jakes all the time because, you know, growing up, I did grow up in a church, but I think I grew up in a church, but as I got older, I kind of stopped going to church and I started listening listening to like more sermons like on the internet. Um, so whenever I'm feeling some type of way or, you know, I just need to hear from God, I put on a sermon. Um, so this morning I put on Sarah Jakes and I just really like her because like she's so relatable I really want to go to one of her conferences but um, yeah I had to put on a word this morning and then I was like let me just come out and get some breakfast today I'm gonna help Ronald with um, his business Ronald has his own insurance agency like he runs it you know what I mean like he has his, his own business and I'm so proud of him um, and I told him that I'm gonna help him with his marketing so I'm gonna do that today. I'm gonna get like some graphic stuff for him. You are one of those people that, you know, you start to feel yourself get into a slump. Girl, recognize it. I think that's the hardest part. I've been in so many slumps, like I know when it's coming, <laughs> but your heart is to just be productive. Like just try, 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 just snap out of it. Like you wanna get out that mindset as quickly as possible and focus on whatever you need to focus on whether it's your family whether it's work whether it's things you need to do around the house you know just get your mind busy and that will help those were my thoughts this morning i am definitely i've mentioned this before i'm definitely an introvert so i think bitch my mind be like going a million miles per hour yes good morning happy monday that was a lot to unpack but <laughs> let's get the day started i'm gonna go help my man run his business baby because <laughs> he the ceo i'm trying to be the vp baby i'm trying to get a raise mm -mm. 
I'm trying to get a raise. Let me go help my man, my man, my man. card I sent you so I think it come by um or many in the 100 um card for 15 dollars so you can buy two we can say thank you card and in each client we can write something so I send every client one of this correct so if you can I get one but this one is in Spanish <laughs> I don't have one in English, so I gotta order it. So I'm gonna find out when I get to the office. <laughs> but anyway, you get the picture. Hey y'all, so it's later on in the day. I did all of the um, graphics for Bruno, and I fixed all of the um, letters he needed me to do, and I ordered all the stuff that he needed. So I laid down for like an hour, but I need to go. Publix really quick because we're out of a lot of stuff. Just go, I made a list of everything that I needed. So far we have, let me show y'all the list. Fruit punch, passion fruit, orange juice. I am craving cookies and chocolate. This is like a struggle fridge right now. I see y'all in the stove. What we got so far is about to get all this stuff. So, yeah, that's what we're working on. I'm looking for some chicken nuggets for Papa, but I think I found some. Update on Papa, he don't have diarrhea no more. I'm so happy about that. I don't know, it just went away on its own. So, that part. I'm gonna put all this stuff up. And then I'm gonna get Papa ready for bed. Why is your phone dead, bro? My phone dead. Why you let that phone dead? Jesus, that was fast. I don't know. Papa, what the oh, hell? Eh, what you got on? What you got on? <laughs> Who put this on you, boy? What you got on? Looking like that. Look at him. What the hell that boy got on? Just matches. It's giving the vibe. I'm gonna make Ronald a little shotty shot. What you drinking, Ronald? I think there's some 1800 over there. Tasting like some fine wine. X broke your heart, you can hear that shit with mine. Niggas be calling, but you never mind. Cause you all mine. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. It's me, Ronald. It's a coffee machine. I just want to see the spaceship. It's a coffee machine. Cheers. It's a great night. I'll be back in a couple of months. Hold on. <laughs> Cheers. That's my fake shot. At Ronald. That shot is gang. A little flustered. A little flustered. <laughs> you ready? Wow, I just, I gotta use the bathroom again.
from. Get a whole outfit. Get in my favorite food. My favorite girl. like we have to do our bedroom completely over so that's what we're supposed to do um, so I'm gonna go ahead and start breakfast and wake them up rushing to my um my doctor's appointment because in the last vlog i had to go back and do a vaginal ultrasound but girl they didn't even do the vaginal ultrasound they just did one on the belly thank the lord for that like i just thought they didn't have the equipment to do the one on the belly so that's why i was getting the vaginal one i don't know but that worked th those were my thoughts but girl if you don't gotta that sounds so ghetto i'm sorry if you don't have to do a vaginal ultrasound, girl, don't do a vaginal ultrasound. Just do the, the just be normal. Like, why do we gotta, why you put me through that pain and we ain't gotta, you ain't gotta put me through that pain. So they just end up doing the um, regular one. I have to go back again because she was turned face down. So they couldn't do the full anatomy scan. Um, all they see was her back. And she wasn't having it. And yes, I'm having a girl. 
I'm so excited. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I posted that. Well, I'm actually going to post it now. But anyway, I posted that I'm having a girl. Oh, my God. Y'all, I'm so excited. Uh, we didn't do like a big gender reveal. Honestly, I just had the gender in this envelope. I came home. We sat on the couch. I thought something fell out. We sat on the couch and opened it. It was sweet. It was like, you know, I don't know. I didn't want to do it. I just didn't want to do a big gender reveal because y'all, like people, people don't really care. I mean, they do, but most people don't care like what you have and they just come to support you, of course, but They really don't care i just really thought i was having another boy so i'm i'm just so excited it's a girl like i just can't wait to just teach her everything like and just be there for her and tell her she's beautiful and just spoil her and just uh, i don't know it just it's starting to hit so much different like like i'm having a daughter <sighs> it's a lot to take in <laughs> but I'm so excited to meet her and for some strange reason I just have a feeling she's just gonna be amazing like I'm I'm just ah! I don't even know what to say so um yeah this is the little thing it came on She's a girl. And even yesterday, the girl, the ultrasound tech, she was like, you're definitely having a girl. So that was double confirmation. And then I have some pics here. So this was from when I went to Bellies to Bellies. Oh, sorry. When I went to Little Bellies, I'm saying their name wrong. Um, these are some pictures of her. That's my baby girl. Hold on, y'all. This is Ronald. Hello? What up, Chicha? Hey. Yo, pants ripped off. What did I get on me? <laughs> you got a hole in your pants? If it was a hole, then it would have been, been straight. <laughs> Wait. You don't got the pants on no more? I do have the pants on, but that shit got a big ass hole in the bottom of it. <laughs> <laughs> what you did bend over and put a hole in it yeah i bend over trying to like i just get on my like kind of like you know bend down not on your kind of trying to get on my knees so i can go ahead and get in the bottom of the desk so i can plug my computer all i heard fresh <laughs> I'm I'm my man home. did you restart your computer or restart it back up yeah, shut down, shut down the computer and do it, open back up the door again. Alright, cool. Hi, Ronald. I do not need you. I gotta clean the shower. I always wanna do something. I gotta clean that bathroom. They ain't gonna catch me slipping. Ronald gonna play golf tomorrow with his friends. <laughs> I'm done cleaning the shower. We're about to go get Papa. 
and get some dinner. Are away. Exit now. Alright. Wanna get purple. Yeah, it's, hot. it's hotter than a... How you doing, Papa? Control your umbrella, sir. <laughs> you causing damage on the feet. <laughs> damage control. <laughs> Goddamn umbrella. <laughs> Flying everywhere.